What's up, gang? Matt Martin from Vehement Knives. I just wanted to do an uh, in-hand video so you could see the proportion and, and relative size of the new model we just put out. Uh, this one in particular is out of 316's ATS-34. It's full tank construction. We did black linen micarta scales on this one. You may have seen the pictures on Facebook that we showed the olive drab canvas. Uh, Want to try something different on this. Nickel silver guard uh, with two brass pins, silver solder joint, satin finish. It's a uh, near full flat grind. Comes comes most of the way up. Nice swedge in here. Let's take a look at the plunges. And then here in the finger choil up front, we radius it so it's kind of it's domed this way. So it's really comfortable if you wanted to get in for fine camp craft tasks. Um, flared stainless steel pins, I don't know if we went over that yet, and a flared brass thong tube. Uh, this one came in at 59 and a half uh, Rockwell on the C scale. And uh, just thought you guys, I, I really enjoy it. It's really comfortable. Um, it's got a good balance to it. I mean, it's sitting right just behind the guard. Oops. Right there. So it has a bias to fall into your hand, which with field knives I'm real big on. Um, as you fatigue, as you get tired from doing tasks, you don't want the knife to ha will have a tendency to want to fall out of your hand. You'd rather it at rest. Even with my fingers open, the knife wants to stay in my hand. So um, we shoot for that that point of balance just about every time. Even on the daggers, it's just behind the guard where your where your finger sits. And so uh, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, we'll see if I burn the rest of my Sunday afternoon making a sheath for this. We'll see. Thanks a lot. Livy Mintley.